release. Yeah. That's fine. Let's record. Am I where I need to be? Hello, Lester Wilkins here. Welcome back to my video blog. In the last episode, we discussed why social media or the importance of social media. In this episode, I'd briefly like to discuss which social media I think you should be using to promote your business and which ones your business will benefit from. There are a ton of different social medias out there and you could spend all day on social media and it could become quite overwhelming. I actually found this on the internet the other day and it describes the differences between social media. It explains social media in a, in a nutshell. Twitter is, I'm eating donuts. Facebook, I like donuts. Foursquare, this is where I eat donuts. Instagram, here's a vintage photo of my donut. YouTube, here I am eating a donut. LinkedIn, my skills include donut eating. Pinterest, here's a donut recipe. Blast FM, now listening to donuts. Google Plus, I'm a Google employee who eats donuts. That's quite funny, and it does go through the different social media, but the point is that there's, social media can become overwhelming. There's a lot of them out there. So which ones should you use for your business? Well, I think the obvious one is Facebook. You should have both a business page and a personal page, and you should use both to generate awareness on, on your business and promote your business. And I'm not going to spend all day on Facebook. I could literally spend a whole episode on it. The next one that you should consider is Twitter. Twitter is the second most popular social media out outlet, and it's a microblogging site that allows you to use 140 characters to promote your business. The nice thing about Twitter is that 71% all, that of Twitter users expect to be marketed to on that platform. So it's a great way to drive business to your blogs or to your website. Another one is LinkedIn. LinkedIn is the only dedicated social media for business. And it's a great way to connect and to learn about other products or services that could benefit your business. And it's a great way to, to inform the consumer and other partners about your business. Using a group would be a terrific way to expand, educate, and create awareness of your, of your business, and it's just a terrific way to connect. Now, a couple that people don't think about are, first of all, YouTube. YouTube is a, a great way to promote your business. Studies show that video marketing is the top way to connect with people and to connect with your partners and your, and your clients. It's, it's here to stay, and it's growing, and you really should consider using video to, to promote your business with, with testimonials or to create product awareness. Another great thing about YouTube using it as a social media is it increases ranking on both the search engines and on the social media platforms themselves. It's also very easy to share. So if you were to post something on YouTube, you can share it across all the platforms. Another one is Google+. Plus. Google+, Plus is, is owned by Google, and it's, so it's backed by one of the largest companies in the world. It allows you to video chat with multiple people at the same time, and it gives you some flexibility over your content. You can, you can segregate your content. You can share your content with some people, and then if you don't want other people to know about it, you can leave them out of that, that content. So it does give you flexibility over your content, which is a very nice feature. It's also, obviously, because it's owned by Google, loved by that search engine, so it, bl it blasts your rankings up in Google. Another, another item I think you should incorporate into your overall social media marketing plan is blogging. Now, blogging in and of itself is not a social media, but what it does for you is it gives consumers a central location to, it gives you a central location to drive your consumers to, and it's very easy to share your products or your services or your educational pieces across the social media using your blog. So I would check out, for blogging, I would check out WordPress or Blogspot, and they're very, very easy to use and very easy to set up, and they're, they're free, which is best of all, right? So I would certainly consider using blogs to promote your business across all the platforms. So this is very overwhelming stuff, and, you, and it's not something you can get into right away and have it all figured out right away. So if I could be a help to you anytime, please don't hesitate to call me. My number is 810-987-1200. Also, I'd love for you to connect with me on Facebook, Twitter, LinkedIn, and Google+, even YouTube. Please connect with me and check out my blogs as well. They're going to be below, okay? Thank you and make a great day.